YouTube, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of day it is you guys are watching this video. Tracks have it back at y'all with another one. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in to 808s and Kicks. So, how did everybody do today? Um, finally got my second pair of these bad boys in. Today we had the Jordan Air Jordan 1 Royal Reimagined released today. Um, yeah, uh, I get it. The shoes sat everywhere. Doesn't make it a bad shoe. It doesn't make it a bad shoe just because the shoe sat. In my humble opinion, I feel like everything went according to plan how Nike wanted it to go. Um, yeah, you know, again, I'm going to say this again. Just because a shoe sits does not make a shoe bad. Now, I'm going to say this. I get it, guys. Everybody wanted this. But Nike gave us this. I get it. But at the end of the day, it did exactly what Nike wanted it to do. You know, we had for the Reimagined series, we've had the Lost and Founds, we've had the Patent Leathers, we've had the Reimagined, uh, you know, the, the Jordan Cement 3s Reimagined, and now these. You know, I get it. But I feel like it, everything, how it went today, it went exactly how it was supposed to go. It definitely, definitely, definitely went exactly how Nike wanted it to go. And you know what, so on and so forth. If you didn't get a pair of these, that's great. But if you wanted a pair of these and you didn't get a pair of these, it's no reason why you couldn't get a pair of these. These shoes were available everywhere, guys. Every single place you wanted to get a pair of these, they were available. Full Locker, Champs, Finish Line. Even a mad amount of pairs were available on, um, on the Sneakers app. If you wanted a pair of these, you could have got a pair. And you know, even on Go or like StockX, these bad boys are selling for under retail. <clears throat> to be honest with y'all, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep one for myself, but I don't know what I'm gonna do with the second one. I might just do a giveaway. None of my homeboys wanted a pair of these. Um, well, I'm not gonna say they didn't want them. I know some of my guys that wanted a pair, they got a pair, but they didn't need me to hook them up with a pair, so. It is what it is. And you know what? Hey. It went down exactly the way Nike wanted it to go down. Plain and simple, guys. Um, yeah. You know, these days we're seeing a lot of Jordan 1s sit in. And you know, the hype used to be there for Jordan 1s. The hype used to be through the roof when it came to Jordan 1s. And these days, you know... A lot of people just ain't gonna for Jordan 1s like they used to. Um, will it come back? Maybe eventually. But you never know, y'all. You never know. Uh, I will say this. I feel like if they would have made the Royal 1s similar to how they did the Lost and Founds with the cracked leather, like the age look, I guarantee y'all they would have flew off the shelves. Hands down. I guarantee you, if they made this pair similar to the Lost and Found with the, with the quality and all that, I guarantee y'all, people wouldn't have been gunning for those crazy and stuff. But you never know. This might be a shoe that people come back to because let's face it, this month of November, it is a lot of stuff dropping, a ton of stuff dropping. I mean, we just had the Cherry 12s release, you know what I'm saying, not too long ago as well. So, you know, not everybody balling like that. Not everybody can buy a pair of sneakers like every other week and stuff, you know? So... Yeah, I get it. I truly get it. But in my humble opinion, I feel like this release went exactly how Nike wanted it to go. They want it readily available. And let's not forget, Nike don't want it to be something. Well, I'm 50-50 I'm on it. Nike didn't want, don't want resellers botting out all the shoes. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. But at the same time, Travis Scott's are limited. Certain collab shoes are limited, so I'm still trying to figure out and understand, you know, how Nike, the, the Nike thought process on how they want to go about certain shoes releasing and stuff. I, I don't get it. I really don't. But it is what it is. But on another note, I also want to talk to you guys about the Supreme Sneakerhead, you know, uh, sweepstakes that I'm in. So for those of you that have voted for me, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys that voted for me helped me advance on to the next round of things. Um, I moved into, I guess you could say, they said it was a top 20 and stuff like that um, in my group. Um, 
it's not over it's not done yet i still need you guys to be sending those votes through i really really appreciate it if you guys do the link will be down here and you know yeah help me help me get there help me get there guys you know i would love to you know win this win this win this competition so i could not only just you know win something but i would like to be able to give back to you guys and stuff too you know do like a free shoe giveaway and stuff like that um when, when i mean i already have plans when whenever my youtube page get monetized i'm damn sure gonna do a free giveaway on sneakers and stuff like a raffle or something or i might do something like going into a finish line and buying whatever pair of kicks off the wall somebody want me to buy just to give back just to show my thank you and appreciation for you guys that's you know saying showing all your support and stuff so please 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 um i think i got about maybe five or four more days before they see who moves on again from this round um i need y'all i need you guys so the link will be down in the description box you get a free vote you don't have to pay if you want to pay that's great that would help me even more but i get it if you guys don't want to you know do a donation or anything you will get a free vote and you can vote as many times as you want in terms of you can vote once a day so you can vote today and then tomorrow you can vote again all the way until the final day of when they will decide who moves on to the next the next round of things so please 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 help me get there help me win this sneak, supreme sneakerhead contest and you know what we're gonna keep this thing rolling but i'm gonna end this thing because i'm starting to catch a slight cold my throat is killing me and i'm gonna go make me some tea but i just want to throw that out there this release went exactly how nike wanted it to go and just because the shoe was sitting doesn't make a shoe bad i feel like it could be timing as well the reason why the release went how it did with these jordans but it is what it is if you copped great if you didn't cop that's also great and you know what we're gonna keep this thing rolling until the next one but other than that i will talk to you guys very soon on the next one stay blessed stay fresh love your loved ones like it's no tomorrow until then i will see you guys very soon on the next one peace